The terrorist attacks on a Brussels airport and metro station left dozens dead and hundreds wounded, and the threat of ISIS continues to grow. But this goes far beyond just one city. We will do whatever is necessary to support our friend and ally Belgium in bringing to justice those who are responsible. And this is yet another reminder that the world must unite. So guys, listen up. We have a lot of big decisions to make in the next few months, and members of Congress are doing their best to keep people safe. One of their plans is an airport security bill that could fend off terrorist attacks. Okay, so if you've ever flown out of a US airport, you know the drill. Take your shoes off, laptops in a separate bin, no liquids, full body scan. It's become almost natural to us. But different countries have different standards for airport security, and travelers coming from outside the US don't necessarily go through the same security measures as in domestic airports. Representative John Katko from New York thinks this is a huge problem. He's got a plan that would require the TSA to collaborate more closely with foreign governments and to assess the security risk from airports that send flights directly to the US. The risk assessment plan would consider things like the number of known or suspected terrorists that have gone through a foreign airport, passenger security screening practices, capabilities, and capacity, and how airport employees are screened. Under the bill, TSA agents could also donate screening equipment to countries that can't afford it. Remember the attempted shoe bomber in 2001? Or the underwear bomber in 2009? Both were traveling to the US from European countries. Now thankfully, both attacks failed, but those who support this bill point to incidents like these and say that it's time to help foreign airports beef up their security. They say that the risk is too high not to. But people against this bill think that those foreign countries should be responsible for their own airport security. And they think that spending TSA resources abroad means neglecting security at home. So where do you stand? Follow the link, head over to Countable, and let your representatives know how you want them to vote on this bill.